Thank you very much. Um, we are at Nairobi West Hospital, uh, Chipukizi or Vincent Moasia, popularly known in the comedy world as Chipukizi, was admitted here last night. We have had a chat with him and uh, we are happy about the progress so far of his medication. The doctors here are doing a superb job. He's since been out of machines and is now in the normal ward. We are here just to, we have had a chat with him as friends. And as you are aware, he had a Chipukizi show on the 5th of August. Following our briefing with the doctor and the surgeons, we have decided to postpone that show. So we have asked him to agree to postpone his show on the 5th of August uh, that was supposed to be held at uh, Mount Kenya University, Mwai Kibaki Convention Hall. And the new dates will be announced as soon as he is uh, out of hospital. So that's why, ladies and gentlemen, I would ask to have a chat with you so that you can help us to communicate that bit. Thank you very much. Maybe just to uh, let us know what was the issue, what was the condition? Without, without going into the confidential bits about his doctor-patient confidentiality, he has some stomach issues. Uh, he has since been undergone several tests. They are waiting for some, some tests. The results are out, some are not. So he's waiting for some results within the day today, mm -hmm. which will then inform what happens tomorrow. Mm -hmm. He's likely to undergo admission here for quite a while. So for now, we leave it at that without going to the specific details. Mm -hmm. uh, as of now, what is the progress and how long has he been in the hospital? He was admitted yesterday evening around uh, 3 p.m. Uh, the progress, as I've said earlier, brilliant, superb, very well done job by the hospital and the medical team here at Nairobi West Hospital. Mm -hmm. Maybe I know uh, we have uh, some people who are kidogo ameshtuka kukuona hapa hivi. What's your relationship with uh, Chipukizi? Uh, Chipukizi, since when he started his comedy, staff has been my friend. Um, uh, he's, uh, he's in Tala where he's building a primary school. He's invited me there, we've done Harambe's there, we've built the school together. Mm -hmm. And beyond that, we run an organization called Radical, which is a group for empowerment of young people mm -hmm. in politics. Mm -hmm. So that's our relationship. It's uh, mostly professional, but it has since metamorphosis into friendship. Uh -huh. And definitely a question that is running through uh, many people's mind is uh, maybe have you uh, seen a fellow artist maybe coming to visit him? Yeah, I've just, uh, I've just when I was walking out, I met a person you were with at the Talanta Hela. I uh, was well, with uh, Eddie Butita yesterday mm -hmm. here, and I'm sure now because it's, this time the information is going out, I'm sure you, you have Jim Olem say was also here. Mm -hmm. it, I, I'm sure because this is the time that the thing is metamorphosizing, mm -hmm. a lot of people will be coming in mm -hmm. and we'll keep you updated. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, which rating can you give the musician so far according to the progress of Chipukis? Uh, sorry, I didn't get that properly. Uh, I'm inquiring the rating that you can rate the musician, their cooperation with Chibukizi. I, I've seen that debate online on whether or not he's been supported by the local art community. I think Chibukizi is too strong to rely on just basically the external support. I think he's received support from his friends. Uh, he has received support from the artistic community. I mean, I've had calls from even his mentors, like uh, this morning I had a conversation with one of his biggest uh, mentors who brought him into, who gave him a platform into the comedy show. So I think, I think, uh, I, I, and, and the all of uh, the African artists who were with him, this, just now we had a chat with them, the ones who had confirmed the consumers and the rest of the people from Africa. So we have just informed them about the sickness. And from Kenya itself, I think so far so good. I think he's received some good support. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All okay. Right. And uh, uh, Dennis, it's Boya here. I would love to, to, to know. Uh, Chief Kizi also works so close to the president. Has the president got the information? Maybe he has been uh, admitted, and what has been insisted? Uh, unfortunately, I haven't uh, haven't briefed the president. But uh, as soon as he's back from Tanzania this evening, I will have him briefed. Mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, my question uh, goes direct to you. You have been, uh, it's now over nine months since you won the election, being in, uh, in the government, the current government constitution. What is the progress so far or the achievements? I knew it would go there. So I, I would recommend that we have another day and I will address myself. I mean, I'm going to unveil a few products.
contacts that I would want us to be communicating with. So I would say today we keep it chipukizi, but I hear you and I agree with you. I mean, if I just walk out of here and haven't spoken government, then you don't have a good story. <laughs> but let's keep it there. Then I am sure I will be calling you again. I'm impressed by the growth of these digital newsrooms, and uh, you can be sure I will make this a big thing. I will give it my support. Okay, okay. Uh, it, uh, I have a question. Uh, if maybe the bill comes out because it is what for the government. Will uh, you, Chunga, and the government come for in? For Chipukizi has no bill to pay. We will handle the bill. <laughs> and it's not government handling the bill. His friends will handle the bill. <laughs> because sometimes, you know, let's also give government. Is, government is for the all, all of Kenyans. They have to do an, an insurance for all Kenyans. But as his friends, surely we can afford a bill for Chipukizi. <laughs> he will not work here with money spent from his pocket. <laughs> So if I may ask, after how long should we expect to see Chipukizi? Uh, this, I am only able to answer that question this evening, so I'm sure we'll exchange contacts. I'll give you a lady called Yvonne who is with me here. She'll keep you briefed in case of anything, so that then you can be able to know. I would be unable because I'm not the doctor, but I'm sure once the results are out, the doctor will be able to advise. Mm -hmm. Maybe just before we leave, uh, I know uh, many Kenyans are expecting to hear from you. Uh, the Baba Tumechuka thing, signatures in the Fika Ngapi. Uh, the last time I checked, that was last uh, last evening, mm -hmm. it was going towards uh, 8 million. I will have to get the right figure, mm -hmm. but I will get you the figure, but it's around 8 million. And th the fact that we started a month after Baba, mm -hmm. that shows that uh, the platform is doing very well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Maybe what next after uh, the votes? Once the signatures are in, we are going to go to Parliament for a review of the Presidential Retirement Bill mm -hmm. so that then we can have it revised for anyone who is involved in politics not to be the benefit of it because that is a law. If you get yourself involved in politics, then you don't get the money from the taxpayers. Mm -hmm. You get to choose, are you retired or are you active in politics? Mm -hmm. If you're active in politics, you look for your money in politics. If you have retired, you continue enjoying your retirement. Mm -hmm. Okay, a quick one. President yesterday said it was Twitter. When he comes back, maybe he lands back, eh? he'll be engaged in Baba. What's your take? Well, the president said, let's wait. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a possibility of a, something like a handshake out of the discussion? I, you know those things are above my pay grade. It's the president and Baba. They are up there. So what you are doing? You are TV. So what you are doing? Okay. And uh, then sometimes you uh, you, uh, you 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 post very. Uh, good things, sometimes we post very funny things. People would love to know, are you the one who run your, uh, your, who, who handles your social media accounts or maybe help someone? Ah, uh, well, I, I, I have people who manage my social media accounts, but I also post on my social media accounts. Mm -hmm. So, but at 99% of the time I'm posting. Mm -hmm. So if the captions and everything is posted, it's always your you. <laughs> Completely, 100%. <laughs> okay. But if you're asking for a job, we can talk on the side. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Just, just, so go. just go. Oh, there is this blogger, Mwenye Alishikwa Juzi, the Azimio blogger. Maybe you can tell us something about that. Pauline Joroge. Well, first of all, I am completely opposed to anyone, including you guys. If any of you is ever arrested and charged on cybercrime law, please call me. <laughs> I may not do much, but at least I'll get your lawyer. Mm -hmm. As for the specific case of Pauline Joroge, where I think is appearing in court today again, for mention, this is what I have to say. The charge of cyber harassment is total nonsense. Mm -hmm. Who can harass William Ruto, President William Ruto, on social media? I mean, we have had insults from 2019, 2018, and before that he had even more insults. Why would anyone take, why would the DPP think that that is a, that is a crime that deserves to be charged? I am completely opposed to those kind of things because I have been charged on those laws. Mm -hmm. They are the most stupid things. I have won, they have charged me four times, I have won four times, and I'm in court making money from them. Why should you continue doing the same wrong thing over time? Mm -hmm. those, the cybercrime law in this country needs an urgent review. Mm -hmm. As it is now, it is, it, is a, it is a law that was made for the typewriter. The, the people who made that law did not envisage the error of the computer. Mm -hmm. It is a law in brief that should be deleted from our society. Mm -hmm. Chipukizi, fight hard, my brother. Fight hard, my friend. Get healed soon. Sitasema uguwa pole, ntasema pona haraka. 
and uh, we really wish him well and I wish that he gets out so that he can get back to what he does best. He, he works for the presidency and he also has a comedy plan for universities that he wants to roll out and uh, both universities and high schools that he wants to roll out from September. So I wish him very quick recovery. By the way guys, in December this year for Jamuri Day we are celebrating with the theme for Jamuri Day this year is creative economy, the sports and the arts. And so Chipukizi will be playing a key role in ensuring that the creative economy has its space and we have a whole one week of celebration. Remember that this year we are also doing Kenya at 60. Kenya is standing 60 years old. Therefore, we need Chipukizi to be healed quick enough we can begin planning. Maybe I can ask my friend uh, Karondo who is with me here and he's also, uh, also the vice chair of Radical where Chipukizi plays a key role just to say something. Just a question. Just uh, let him speak and then I'll take a question. All right, thank you very much.